On 530, Berkeley city leaders are meeting at this hour to settle a bitter battle over some trees. The matter's gotten so heated, the trees got their own task force. Good evening, I'm Alan Martin. I'm Veronica Dela Cruz. The plan was to cut down a number of mature trees the locals have been tending in traffic circles. But KPX 5's John Ramos reports it seems the city may have had a change of heart. When is a tree more than just a tree? In Berkeley, it's when it becomes a matter of principle. For years, the landscaping in Berkeley's residential traffic circles has been maintained by the people who live nearby. But in May of last year, city staff recommended that all the trees in the circles be cut down because they obstructed the view of drivers. Predictably, a lot of people thought that was not a good idea. Absolutely not. In fact, I think they support rather than detract. The decision was a result of a $2 million lawsuit settlement when someone was injured in the crosswalk at this intersection. This tree was alleged to have contributed to the accident. But when more than 1,000 residents signed petitions, the mayor created a citizen task force to work with staff engineers who then recommended that only trees up to six inches in diameter would be allowed. And they seemed perplexed by the idea that that you couldn't guarantee a tree would only be six inches in diameter that trees grow. The task force discovered that other cities like Seattle require trees in their traffic circles and that federal traffic guidelines recommend them to make circles more visible and possibly prevent what happened in Berkeley two weeks ago. This evening, after a year and a half of studying the issue, the council is meeting to make a final decision. Well, we hope this, the council agrees with us and, and approves our policy recommendations. That trees are a good thing. Trees are a good thing. <laughs> and that may be happening because this morning, emails from the city went out saying staff was no longer recommending removing any trees. Whether that was from the persuasiveness of the argument or the ire of the voters is anyone's guess. I think maybe uh, they've had some people talk some common sense into them about uh, not confronting the neighborhood. So I like to think that we made a difference. <laughs> <laughs> to paraphrase Joyce Kilmer, I think that I shall never see a legal brief as lovely as a tree. The city may have seen the wisdom in that, and it's got to be driving the lawyers crazy. In Berkeley, John Ramos, KPIX 5. Well, the council is still discussing the matter right now. When they do reach a decision, we'll go ahead and post an update for you on KPX.com.